your host for Motor Week, John Davis. Well, hello and welcome again to Motor Week. We're glad to have you with us. In the world of full-size pickup trucks, four doors are all the rage. Rear doors turn a workhorse into a family vehicle with almost unlimited uses. Well, if four doors work on big trucks, they should do gangbusters for compact trucks. So much so that Mazda is really promoting this new four-door B-Series pickup as the answer to every family's trucking needs. So let's see if more compact doors mean full-size success. Well, the success of the four-door Mazda B4000 Cab Plus can only be determined by the yardstick you choose to measure it by. If you're looking for a sporty little extended cab pickup with total access to the room behind the front seats, then you've come to the right place. If, however, you're looking at that room as a regular place to haul adults, then it's clear that even with rear doors, a compact truck is still a compact truck. But for the ability to easily load everyday items like groceries and shopping bags in a secure dry space, yet retain the full capabilities and agility of a compact pickup, the B4000 Cab Plus is a home run. The Cab Plus rear jump seats always were adequate for small children. The rear doors now make them a snap to reach. Plus, the youngins can't hop out until you want them to. The front door must be open for a rear door to unlatch. That's pretty much standard for rear pickup doors, as is the rear door release on the door jam that strikes us as a bad place to have anyone's hand. But we never had a case of a door closing accidentally. When the rear seats are pressed into service, the kids will be safely strapped in thanks to adjustable door-mounted shoulder belts. The rear room in the Cab Plus also pays dividends for the front seaters by providing more leg room and seat back tilt angle than the B-Series regular cab. The manually operated 60-40 split front buckets are comfortable and larger folks will appreciate the tall seat backs and the tilt steering wheel, as well as the comprehensive gauge cluster that includes oil pressure and voltmeter gauges. The large, well-marked controls of the AM-FM CD stereo are perfectly placed so they fall easily to hand, as do the smooth rotary controls that operate the heating and air conditioning just below. The passenger airbag deactivation key switch is also close by. But the small storage tray in front of the floor-mounted cup holders is too far up under the dash to be readily accessible. Better to use the space under the armrest or the small pockets in the rear doors. While for more serious loads, the standard six-foot bed will take on just about anything thrown in its direction. And muscle it down the road in either 4x2 or 4x4 configurations by one of three available power plants. A 2.5-liter four-cylinder, a 3-liter V6, or our test truck's 4-liter pushrod V6 that delivers 160 horsepower and 225 pound-feet of torque. All engines come hooked up to a standard 5-speed manual or optional 4-speed automatic transmission. Only the B4000 is available with the optional 5-speed automatic, a feature the B4000 shares only with its close kin, the Ford Ranger. This engine and trans combo moved our 4x2 down the track to 60 in 10.4 seconds and on through the quarter mile in 17.7 .7 seconds at 76 miles per hour. The 4-liter gives the B4000 a somewhat torquey leap off the line and power stays consistent throughout the rev band, although nothing short of manual shifting would get it anywhere near the 6,000 RPM limit. The brakes, however, were regularly pushed over their limits as time after time the ventilated front disc rear drums with rear-only ABS continued to lock one or more of the wheels without warning. Distances were very inconsistent, ranging from 145 to 170 feet. The four-wheel ABS system option is a must. Handling, on the other hand, is very competent and predictable. Our drivers like the smooth feel of the power-assisted rack and pinion steering. A double wishbone coil spring gas shock suspension with stabilizer bar holds the front in place. While at the back, the semi-floating solid axle is located with two-stage multi-leaf springs, gas shocks, and a stabilizer bar. Together, they keep push and body roll to a minimum. Ride quality has improved considerably over earlier B-Series, thanks to the full boxing of the front section frame rails, which improved structural rigidity by more than 350%. And of course, the B4000's Cab Plus wheelbase of 125.7 inches doesn't hurt either. And neither does the B4000's unique styling that sets it apart from its Ranger cousins and gives the B4000 a look that Mazda's research indicates import buyers are looking for. 
a lower, more horizontal appearance that's fronted by a grille and headlights that form a horizontal band across the front before wrapping the corners. The B4000 also avoids the same old slab-sided look by tucking the bed in behind the cab before it swells out over the rear wheels. Available in SX and SE trim levels, the B4000 is not only competent in carrying your goods, it's also pretty good at carrying a competitive price. Base price on the Mazda B4000 is $17,080. Our tester equipped with the optional power package that includes 15-inch alloy wheels, a host of interior power goodies, and $1,200 in discounts, total $21,355. With comparably equipped full-size trucks costing thousands more, the B4000 may be just the ticket for those with moderate family trucking needs. And with its more usable interior thanks to four access doors and powerful 4-liter V6, the Mazda B4000 Cab Plus proves by our measure that you can successfully offer plenty of full-size pickup features without carrying a full-size price. Coming up, the Jeep that won the war.